subscribe or this will happen to you. <laughs> yeah, you're not subscribed yet? Come on! Hi right, guys, we are back. We are training for Bahrain once again. Um, tonight it is spicy log press with the three spicy stoke men. Stoke men, remember that, right? Hey, so log press, I'm going to be doing two sets of three, uh, 150. It's meant to be from just the chest, but I'm going to clean each one uh, so I can get that position each time. Success. Is that a leaf out of Tom's book? Is yeah. it? Yeah, he gave me one. Not a used one, mind. <laughs> this is a fact of 2021. Cows can't see underwater. Why is that? Trust me. Just trust me on that. Cows cannot see underwater. They're sensitive, the, wa the waters, when they touch water, their eyes get sensitive and they close up. I know my cows. Oh that was one of Harry's last sets there. Um, he did a couple of sets and, and his elbows were a little bit splayed, um, so a little bit kind of open. When your elbows are open a little bit, you don't get as much power, you don't utilise as much triceps. Um, so we kind of corrected that with Harry and that was his, probably his best set. He really had that nice and tucked in and as he drove with his legs, you could see the triceps engage and really control that lockout. So the logs, I think, one of the most technical lifts that, that we do as, as strongmen. So it's those like fine margins, you know, a little couple of mil here, a few mil there, and it makes all the difference. So um, I suspect Harry's going to be one of the best log pressers in the world soon. So when you're doing it, here, your elbows are going to be splayed out. Uh -huh. So keep them tucked under a bit, okay. rather than out the gap. So if you keep them gap, you get more power from your triceps. How are you finding the coaching between Tom and Luke? <laughs> Two different types of coaching going on here. <laughs> Luke's a... Uh, I'd say a lot better at coaching than Tom. Excuse me, <laughs> Luke's the best in the yeah. world. <laughs> He's the best in the world at long. I keep my secrets to myself and give him 80%. No. Tom's, Tom's way of training and coaching is just add more weight. If you can't do it, just add a bit more weight. That's what I got told it. when I was younger. By who? Luke. He was just like, oh, you're not allowed. Every week I kept going up and every week I embarrassed myself. So just trying to. He's still, he's still embarrassing himself. <laughs> Go, Harry. How's training done? Train's awesome, as you can hear, um, my breathing is getting bad again, which means I'm getting bigger, which is a good sign. I <laughs> know oh, it's not a good sign, but for me it's like, I was getting skinny and didn't really like it, so. So because Tom and I are a little bit thicker, we can rest it on our chest. 
So you see when I'm here pressing, you're quite straight. Your, yeah. your, your back's quite straight. Yeah. But when Tom and I are pressing, there's a good curve. So when we're, we've got that. So our, our shoulders, if you like, or we're pressing, is almost over our hips. You need to make a wee shelf. Yeah, a little Probably. shelf. So if you're, if you're straight like that pressing every time, yeah. it's going more out in front of you. Yeah. Your, your hand position's away from your hips, so you're not getting as much drive. So when you're pressing, it's, it's more of a struggle. Yeah. Whereas you're pressing like that, it's up and it's straight over yeah. every time. And you're getting that drive because that's your st the strongest points in line with your hips. So if you can get your um, the way you're pressing the log, so it's not out in front of your hips yeah. by doing that little arch in your back. It's just, it'll come in time, but. I think I'm using, I'm thinking about using my legs and the drive on my legs. Yeah. I'm not, not thinking about what I'm doing up top. Yeah. So so I need who, to do, who would strip it down to one for 10? Yeah. I sign and just try and get it after you. Like that, yeah. try and go like that. So I'll just do a, a little demo of what I thought Harry was doing. And then I'll show him what I think he should be doing, if that makes sense. So. Harry's clean is really good, squats down, hits it up, but he's quite straight. So watch my hips, they get popped forward. I've got little arcs in my back, I'm not popping up, but I'm not. It's out in front. So it's just that difference um, when it goes heavy. Your best stabilising position is when the log's directly above your hips. If it's out in front, that's when you see the balance issues. So that's what we'll need Harry to do. So he's going to give it a wee go. Yeah, tennis. Mm. Harry the hurricane. <laughs> <coughs> so do one normally, how you normally do. such mobility wise Harry's very good but it looked when he did it normally when he was pressing it was that so if I stand like that when he was there the elbow's a little bit flayed he's pressing and it's there so you can see my hands out in front, out in front of me and there's only so much you can kind of have in that position you put that little bit of an arch use that barrel chest as a as a shelf pop it up straight over and my hands, hand position's kind of changed. So you can see the hands, like it should be in line with my kind of hips. So that's, that's, that's that line that you're wanting to kind of create, that solid base and that really improves your stability when you're pressing the log. How did your sets go, Tom? Yeah, it was good. Two sets of three. It's nice because obviously um, the log hasn't been going very good the last few weeks. Just I'm starting the next phase of my diet and I'm feeling bigger again and stronger. And uh, yeah, two sets of three, 150 up and down each time. <laughs> Not up and down, clean and press each time. It felt good. So onwards we go. Thank you guys for all the love and support you give myself and Luke. I appreciate it all. Harry the Hurricane is coming to sweep us away. <laughs> Log finished. Um, we ordered very well. It was very spicy. Harry did great. Luke did great. Harry did great. We're doing bench press now. He said Harry King. Did you have a candy cane without Harry King? Real YouTube stars now with all the lighting, huh? Just as good as that TikTok, we should, we're going to get those ring rights next, right? Oh. 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 
ちは Are you looking forward to Bahrain? I'm well looking forward to Bahrain on a private island. Just myself, Luke, and athletes. So it'll be cool. Yeah, I'm ready. We've just done bench press there, so we did uh, triples. Obviously, we've got the, the series that we're doing is the road to Bahrain, so we've got about five weeks, I believe, until we're competing there. So we really need to up the strength, so we're doing triples, um, which is a good one for Tom and I for improving strength. So went up to max weight was 180, uh, four plates aside for three reps. That felt okay. But just again, with a flat bench, it's because we don't do too much of it, or we haven't done for the last couple of, couple of months, two, three months. Um, it's quite sore in the joints, I find, so we just need to kind of go careful and go kind of conservatively um, when we're pressing. So that's what we did. So now we're going to go on to incline dumbbell press. So we'll see what weights we can hit there. First log press 2021 done. Um, we worked on a little bit of technique with Harry. So he did really well actually. The, the kind of technique's coming really nicely for him. Um, Tom was working on strict press, feeling okay. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. And then I was just doing conventional log press and we did some bench press, dumbbells, accessories. So that's it done. So we're going to do a little dip in the cold and hot, get home, get eating, and we'll see you in the next video. So. Stay safe, smile, stay spicy. And guys, keep ringing that little bell. Ding 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 